Now, my next guest is a social media superstar, Mrs Hinch. In just five years, her housework hacks have earned her millions of followers online. She's gone on to release a number of best-selling books. Her latest is the children's book, Welcome to Hinch Farm, which is out today. And Sophie Hinchcliffe joins me now. Sophie, it's so lovely to see you. Thank you for having me. Congratulations on everything that you, you're you. doing. I love this whole idea. Oh. And there's a lovely story. Look, I know, isn't it gorgeous? Look, there's your llamas. <laughs> Oh, there's your doggy, there's the kids, and welcome to Hinge Farm. It's kind of based on you, on, on your yes. life, really. Yes. It's a it's a um a family treasure, shall we say, for us. Oh, so it's lovely. Um, so very grateful to get to do it. No, it's it's great, it's really good. And are your children tidy? Are they organised? No, no of course far not. from it. They're too wee. Two toddlers, Lorraine, I've given up. No, exactly, <laughs> exactly. But it's not so much about I mean, I'm I'm terribly tidy, like really tidy. Um Cleaning. Mm. Do you enjoy but cleaning? I do. Oh, that's and I, good. And I do, actually. I don't enjoy it at the time, but afterwards. The feeling. Oh, of, at of the just, end. It's good for you, isn't it? Sorry. It really is, Sophie. There's something about it. It's a wee bit like you get the house sorted out, but also the garden, and if you're lucky enough to have one, or the area round about you. See, this is where I think you could really be amazing, because you've sorted houses. Can you now sort the, the amount of people that throw litter about? The environment. Can we clean it up? Wouldn't that be good? I would love to. You I would love to. You could do it. At the moment, I feel like all I'm doing is cleaning up alpaca poo and uh, now, chicken poo. Tell me about the alpacas, because you've got... Now, how cute, on a scale of cuteness, and oh. oh, no, look at <laughs> that. It's ridiculous. Don't you think they look like little people with pyjamas on? I think I've... Um, Oh, wow, that just makes me look, not look normal at all, does it, when he comes <laughs> in the house like that? But I'm um, in. <laughs> they do come in. They do come well, in the house. Of course they do. Um, I've made them more into dogs, I think, Lorraine. Yes. I think that's the problem. But they are... You know, they're, they're amazing. They've really changed our lives. We've really enjoyed having them with us in our family. They're so and, cute. Um, look at them waiting at the door. Waiting to, and look at the dog. He loves them as well. <laughs> My house looks How crazy in this footage. No, I, no, I love it. I just love the whole thing. Why do you think that, you know, it's, it's now five years ago, isn't it? Why do you think you, you struck such a chord with people? What was it about... Because the connection you made was remarkable. If, if I'm perfectly honest, I... To this day, it's been a long time. I still don't quite mm. know how it's taken off to I mean, be it's as it is. But, it's wonderful. Um, I just think we needed somebody to tell us how to sort ourselves out. Oh, well, I asked my mum, if I'm honest, <laughs> most things. Um, but no, it's um, my, my followers are um, phenomenal. Like they're incredible. The support they give me and my family. It's enabled us to do things that we could only ever dream of, you know. And and to watching things practice. like that <laughs> makes me just think. <laughs> I'm not OK. Um, no, I think no, it's brilliant. It's, it's, it's been incredible. It really is. I mean, you and Stacey Solomon, it's like, I know you're oh, she's both... she's amazing. You're great friends. <laughs> and you've managed to sort of, you know, make everybody just think about it. We're not saying you have to have the perfect house, because nobody has. No, and no. you don't want a show house. You want a home, a warm, friendly home um, with alpacas, <laughs> which I think would be <laughs> amazing. But there's lots of things you can do. Tell me about the declutter jar, because this is oh, a the great idea. Jar. I'm obsessed with it at yeah, the moment. So what do, you, really what do we do it. here now? So it's as simple as a jar yes. filled with numbers from 1 to 30. OK. Fold it up. Yeah. And then each day when you get the chance, you just take one out. Yeah. And you find that number of objects around the home or garden. It could be as little as a button to a piece of furniture. It could be right. a wide range. And you just either recycle it you donate it, you Good idea. get rid of it, you bin it, you just empty that amount of items. Right. Um, and I've, I'm hooked, I'm hooked. I think I've only got a few left in my jar, but seeing everyone else doing it has... has John, well, that's a really, really good idea. It's fun. Like you say, it doesn't have to be a big giant thing. No, no, it could, it be, could be a be hair a... clip and a button, it yeah. could be, but just little things that you don't realise build up. Right. And um, I'm loving it. My is husband, that... not so much, because his no. boxes are gradually And it's vanishing. like, where's, where's that thing? <laughs> Gone. It's me. But it's gone. I've got your voice in my head when I am going through and I think to myself, I, ha I know I love that jumper, but I haven't worn it for two years. Yes. So actually someone else could, could have the joy of that. Of that. Yeah, someone else definitely. could have the, the, the pleasure of that great jumper or whatever it may be. I think it's yeah, great. Thank and, you. and Welcome to Hinge Farm is beautiful. The illustrations are gorgeous. Oh, Hannah's incredible. I love that you've got... I mean, <laughs> there are alpacas everywhere. I think I'm alpaca mad. It's, it's, it's a crazy. Listen, thing. The but next thing has to be the alpaca get their own spin-off. Oh, 100%. Could you imagine? Do it. Do it, do it, do it, Sophie. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for having me. I love me. this. It's gorgeous. And just keep doing what you're doing. Mm. Sorting the nation out. Oh. Sorting the nation out. <laughs>